it going, everybody? Hi from the River of Life. Obviously, we're not at church today. The church is on vacation. We're out here in the Oregon Dunes celebrating our independence. I just wanted to greet everybody, see how you were doing, um, let you know we still love you. So you didn't miss us today because we didn't have service. But uh, I just wanted to mention um, our freedom, how important it is. Not just because of the men and women that have sacrificed in their families. That's important to me. I see the families that go through the struggles too. When our men and women are in the military and they sacrifice their time and sometimes even their lives for our freedom, but also for the freedom that Jesus gives us. In John 10.10, 10, he says, uh, the thief comes to steal, kill, and destroy, but I come that you have life and have it more abundantly. And that abundant life is about that freedom. It's about that right to choose. There's another scripture that Jesus, that it says Jesus held captivity captive so we could be free. Not so we would have to serve him, but so we could choose again, once again, to be free from the things of sin and free from the things in our lives that have, have held us down. He held that captive so we could be free. And I just wanted to get online today and talk to you for a few minutes about the freedom that we have and how important it is not just to thank the men and women that have fought for that freedom but thank Jesus for the freedom that he's given us and the right that he's given us to be free and once again choose what we want to do choose what we want to serve him or choose what we want to do something else because the enemy all he wants is to bring us down to beat us down and to cause us not to uh, live life to the fullest but Jesus gave us that right to live life to the fullest and that's what we're doing out here we're enjoying our time, we're enjoying our freedom, and we're enjoying being with friends and family. And I hope today you're enjoying that too. And as, as you're with friends and family, that you take the time out to be thankful to those who made the sacrifice and thankful for the sacrifice that Jesus made in our lives. And uh, that's all I have for you today. So um, I hope you have a good day and enjoy the rest of your weekend. And God bless you.